One thing that people often forget about when they're purchasing a high-end 3D scanner is that you need a pretty good computer to be able to process that. So um, some typical specs that I strongly recommend, if you have an Artec uh, Eva or a Spider, you need a minimum of 64 gigabytes of RAM. For Leo, I would recommend 128 gigabytes of RAM, if not more. So there's a combination of three things that affects uh, scan processing speed, CPU, GPU, and storage. Get a good CPU, at least i9. Get a good GPU, gotta be NVIDIA, at least eight gigabytes. Get as much RAM as you can. And, uh, and a real key factor is using a solid state drive. Artex Duto reads and writes to the drive quite frequently. So a high speed solid state drive will increase your scanning processing time quite significantly. I've done the tests. It's a eight to nine times uh, factor in time savings from a kind of a low end standard computer to a industrial grade PC. We really like computers from Eurocom, uh, built here in Canada and Ottawa, um, but there's lots of options. RAM, uh, processor, video card, solid state drive. If all those things, you'll get great scans quick. So at this point, our tech studio doesn't work uh, in Apple's operating system. You can run a Windows emulator and Apple computers uh, work pretty well. Some features are restricted, specifically a high definition. Uh, you need an NVIDIA card to run the high definition algorithms from our tech studio. So for all you Apple users out there, maybe one day, uh, but the architecture is pretty different. So get yourself a dedicated scanning PC. Uh, we often will uh, scan with a computer, do the processing, and then be doing something else on another PC. That's usually the most efficient way to go. I do recommend laptops so it's portable like your 3D scanners.